Good morning. Let's discuss the identification of organic catalysts using graph theory based reaction model. My name is Roshan Krahat and I'm a part of Dr. Jim Cleave's research group. I'm a freshman studying computer science at the University of Science and Technology, Pakistan. Delving into the project, organic catalysts are small organic catalysts that are particularly useful as they give rise to outstanding stereoselectivity. The organic catalysis we are interested in is a minimum catalysis, which is a frequently used strategy used to activate alpha, beta, unsaturated carbonyl compounds, which provides a reversible formation of aluminium ions. The aluminium catalysis is carried out via reaction series exploder developed by previous YSPs. The process involves writing an aluminium catalysis rule and adding it to the reaction network of previous rules. Then glycoaldehyde, ammonia, and water were added to the network, and we ran this network for four generations, checking the output of a theoretical sample against actual experimental outputs. Looking at our outputs, we see two products in generation one to a growth of 151 products in Generation 3 and over 2,000 in Generation 4. These products vary in size and complexity as the generation grows. Looking deeper in, we see aldehydes and amides showing up repeatedly as our products, though, though not all these molecules need necessarily to exist which means our theoretical sample has to be tested against actual experimental values in order to be verified. Furthermore, if we analyze the compound similarity by structure between the aldehydes produced separated by their amines, we see, get the following structure. We were able to create a four-generation aluminum catalysis network that allowed us to study real-life processing, though uh, improvement can be made with better filtering and customization. I would like to thank Dr. Jim Cleaves and everyone who supported, guided, and taught us through this experience. These are some references and further resources. Thank you so much.